All right, here's a quick update on our uh, EV conversion for our 71 VW Super, Super Beetle. So uh, back in the hangar and uh, ready to get back at it again. And so, so you can see here I've got the coupler attached to the shaft of the electric motor. And it took me a couple of tries to do this, actually three, because um, I was using the heating element right here. And I was able to get the surface of the element up to about 600 degrees. However, the coupler was uh, heating up unevenly. And so the first two tries, the coupler uh, uh, heated up properly about halfway up uh, the length of it. And then uh, I was only able to get the coupler about halfway onto the shaft before it would stop. And so what was happening was is the, the upper part of the coupler right here, this area in here, was not getting hot enough, it wasn't expanding open enough. And so, third try, I ended up using uh, this little uh, propane torch to uh, heat the upper part of it. And so, uh, then using my probe here, I got it to about 350 to 400 throughout the whole uh, coupler. And sure enough, it just slipped on like butter, man. It just clicked on real fast. And so I held it in place for about a minute and then, um, and then uh, set the set screw right there uh, onto the uh, the key that goes right inside there. So it's on there just the way it's supposed to be. So next step is uh, installing the flywheel. And so I'm gonna put the flywheel on, put this plate like that, then bolts, and those bolts will go into the end of the uh, coupler. And I don't know what torque, so I'm probably just gonna use uh, some thread locker uh, medium strength. And then with this this plate right here, I can know if I can get it out with my fingers. And once the bolt is in position, then I'll just kind of fold back the edge of it to keep the, uh, the bolt from uh, rotating. So anyway, next little part of this video, I'm gonna have the uh, flywheel on in place and uh, we'll keep moving ahead. See ya.